He's drinking his 40. No, I'm not. In 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. What's up, everybody? Welcome to episode 37. I'm your host, Fresh Philly. And guess who's back? Guess who's back? back sneakers, again. sneakers <laughs> have God. I am the God. I you're want to not. Know. Bitch, I'm the God. No, you're not the Mexican Zeus. No, bitch, sneakers at God. Let me live. <laughs> it's your boy, Nesto, because last week episode, fucking Breon. <laughs> it's okay. He was a nervous bitch. He was like, <laughs> Stop. <laughs> Love you, Breon. First time for everything. You know what I'm saying? That's what she said. First time for everything. Uh, So, yeah, Nesto is back for episode 37. He feeling a little better. Little bitch. <laughs> hey, hey. Hey, <laughs> I got to get healthy. <laughs> you said healthy or hefty? Both. <laughs> um. So, yeah, man. Uh, We back at it again for episode 37. Uh, Super hot today, bro. Bro, nah, today's actually was pretty cool. Yesterday, bro, it was almost 90. Was it really? Yeah, today I think only went up to like 85, 86. The, the fact that we bitching about like 80s, like 80 uh, degree weather. I know down south and Cal, huh, y'all cute. <laughs> Facts, y'all, <laughs> y'all cute. cute. Y'all cute. Bro, I am not meant for the heat, bro. I fucking hate it. You're Mexican. I still hate it. You, were, But you're Mexican. I ain't grow up down there. That's why I hate it. True. My my ass, like never liked summer, fucking for hate one it. reason, one reason only, cause it, the bugs. Not even the bugs, bro. It's just Breon outside. It's just like I, I hate being sticky. Yeah, that fucking humid. Like eighty, I can do. Eighty five. All right, you push. Okay, it. if it's eighty, but it's just like sun beaming. If it's eighty and fucking humid, no. So. Nine degrees uh, and raining. <laughs> if it's cool, not humid. Nine degrees and raining. That's humid. I'm staying I inside. Know, exactly. <laughs> nah, but um, either this this week or next week, technically, or like by the end of the month, I'm probably going to turn on my air. I'm letting you know now. Um, you said turn it on? I probably will. Like the central Bro, air. look at me. I'm in a tank top and shorts. Well, it's for them. They be bitching. Kick them out. I wish. <laughs> Kick him out. Put him next to the boiler downstairs. Something, bro. But kick him out. But uh, I don't know. Hopefully they don't hear the, the fan in the background. You think so? If we're quiet, yeah, but mm. eh, maybe uh, I. Right. Um, they can stop bitching. Hold on. Uh talk to the people. I forgot to turn uh close my window. No, he a kinky whore. He was doing some shit earlier. But uh what was it? Yeah, it's just it's the sneakers that got our one today on what was it? The Air Max ones. What the hell they call it? What? Minka, Mica, Mica green. green, whatever fucking green. But I ended up canceling them joints. Why? Uh, cause they're potentially, potentially, the lost and found is going to restock. So I was I, like, I could double up on those. Yeah, why? When you get a pair of my, uh, the Air Max One greens. Yeah, but I rather double up on the lost and found. To be honest, I feel like a lot are going to go to the Nike outlet. What the? The Micah Greens. You think so? Oh, yeah. Because think of it like this, right? If pairs are already sitting low-key on the sneakers app... Well, there's only like three sizes available. Yeah, yeah. I know for a fact, right? At least, I would say 30 to 50% are resellers that bought it, right? Mm-hmm. Thinking they can flip or make a couple bucks. Now, they're going... What 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 are they going to do? Get, the, get their money, mm-hmm. and now they're going to return it. And then these... Outlets are going to have all these fucking shoes, right? True. And it's going to sit and sit. It's going to be 30% off later. I guarantee. Because think about how else would a fucking outlet get like these type of releases? Yeah. I mean, well, it all depends. Uh, speaking of that fucking shit, uh, when the Weissman 3s dropped, uh-huh. I think a week or a week or two weeks later, I went to the outlet right there in Jersey, the mm. one that we can't fucking pronounce. Glousker, whatever. Glucose. Glucose, Glousker, whatever. They had the fucking threes in there, bro. Simonimonimonim. 
<laughs> but they one? they had the the Nike the Nike factory store. Wait, what three? And the white oh. the reimagines. Wait, what? Yeah, they <laughs> had them there, and nobody said nothing. Uh, cause me and my brother walked in just to see like what clothes or bullshit. Wait, what, what size were they? <laughs> Biggest fucking size available. What? Size fifteen. That was the only ones in stock. How much they there. go for? Uh, same price. No, I'm talking about like we t- uh, uh market. Uh, market. I don't know. You didn't check. Nah. I would have grabbed it just to fucking try Fuck to flip it. No, I wanted it for myself. Cause my little brother walked by. He was like, "Bro, they got him." Ask. And one lady overheard, like, "Nope, biggest size we have is a 15." I was like, "Fuck." I was like, I'll triple sock it. Triple, bitch. <laughs> um, so, yeah. Uh, that's basically what happened for you last week. Any uh, pickups? Did I pick up anything? Uh, I got some Dreamville Crocs. <laughs> you. <laughs> They're comfortable, bro. I don't know why you hate on them so much. Because Crocs are retarded. They're fucking comfortable. Um... There you go. Already dropping the R word. I'm trying. I'm really trying to change myself. Nah, fuck that shit. This shit is a raw podcast. If you don't like it, get the fuck off the podcast. I said what I said. You won't say it though. Retarded. <laughs> I said it. Like I said, this now, is raw. Uh, what you gonna call it? So new, new, new. Uh, how do you say this? Because I'm, I'm going to withdraw right now. Uh, <laughs> He missed me. <laughs> uh, damn, how is it? Yeah, basically, I'm going through withdrawal because I haven't been smoking nicotine. Oh, yeah, and, you uh, fucking fiend. <laughs> and, um, yeah, man, I, <coughs> this, this, this shit's fucking getting annoying. I've been chewing gum a lot. Try a new drug. What? I'm not sucking dick, man. <laughs> I never said suck dick. I said try a new drug. Exactly. I don't want to suck dick. <laughs> go do yeah, some... suck dick for crack. <laughs> I was about to say, go do some coke. <laughs> But nah, not the drink. <laughs> uh, so now that I feel like I think it's gonna be a shit show until maybe a week or two. I give you a month. Give me a month. I give you back, a month. Till I go back or till I actually like feel normal. Ah fuck. <laughs> Ain't gonna lie. There's times where like I'm about to like. Uh, well, you feel- have a family. I give you a month till you go back. <laughs> I can literally go to the corner store and just buy something. Exactly. <laughs> and if you hit it, you ain't gonna hit it in front of me. You probably go sneak off and do it in your nah, car. Fuck, I'll still hit that shit in front of my family. I don't give a fuck. I'm a grown ass man. And once I get bitched at and I fucking go walk away. Facts. <laughs> Anyways, let's get into it, y'all. Uh first question of the day. Um, you think these resellers are buying early pairs just for clout to say they have them first? <clears throat> Hell yeah. It, the reason why I bring this up is because uh, I forgot the name of the account or the store. Dude bought a shitload or got a shitload of Thunder Fours, right? Mm-hmm. And people were saying they were fake. Mm-hmm. And he posts receipts that he got verified through StockX. Mm-hmm. Now, hear me out. StockX is StockX. Goat is Goat. Goat, yeah. And eBay is eBay, right? <clears throat> Everyone gets got soon. Like not everyone could do 110%. Fact. You know what I mean? Not even Nike, I feel like, could do 110%. Mm-mm. But, you know, him showing off all these early pairs at Thunder 4s, I don't know how much he sold them for. Really don't care. But it's the fact that the main main question, like, I'm going to go back to it, is do you think these resellers are only getting early pairs just for a clout? Because you think about it. When you buy early pairs, when you are the first person to touch an early pair, mm-hmm. how much do you think you're really paying, right? And then you're going to have to sell it to a consumer. How much are Higher, they yeah. willing to pay? Yeah, I mean... Tax on tax on tax. Pretty much. It's just a tax, a whole tax chain. Because, <clears throat> yeah, I get it. You buying an early pair, you want to flex and be like, yo, I got these now. Mm. Versus, like, why are you going to wait until the release date? Mm. But, like, yeah, they do it for the cloud. But at the same time, bro, y'all fucking paying so much for early pairs, bro. Because what they go for right now? I haven't even looked. I'm going to probably say fours. I think they're around three. Here, check real fast. Fours or threes? We doing this live. So, Thunder fours <clears throat> are, like, my top ten. Mm-hmm. And they are definitely in my... Actually, no, top five. Top five, I'll, top five. I'll, I'll, I'll put them up there, like... I love my white cements. Yeah, I was right. Four forty five for, for my size. size. How yeah. about my size? Nine point five. 
439. Okay, so around four then. Yeah, four close to five. So for me, right, the like my top five fours, of course. Why some I'm going from uh one to five, right? White cement fours, black cement fours, uh lightning force, uh probably thunder force, mm-hmm. and that cool gray force. Ooh, like, okay. The first, the white cement fours are my favorite fours of all mm-hmm. time. You know what I mean? Um, of course, I can't like say the fucking M and M's or the right, encore. Right. Uh, no, I said encore. Uh, uh, undefeated. Undefeated. If I got to choose, it would be the undefeated fours. Facts. But God knows, I can never afford that. Nor <coughs> will I probably find one in my size that's wearable. Facts. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, because I feel that. I got the same list. I think the only thing I would change from the Cool Grays would be the Fire Red Force. I like them. Yeah, Fire Red Force are cool. I like them. But, you know me, right? Yeah. Man, I don't really care for You're Red like that. You're a Crip. That. It's understandable. Jesus Christ. First Chino as a Crip. Yo, is that true? Who? You. No, motherfucker. <laughs> the fuck? I'm not even, yo, first off, <laughs> I don't gangbang over here. Right? That's I, a lie. Have you seen this man see walk? I have him teaching me. <laughs> I'll teach you how to fucking lick my booty hole. <laughs> Anyways. Um, so, yeah, like, the Thunder Force. I know you're going to probably get a pair. Fuck, yeah. I, I hope I get a fucking pair. I mean, if I don't get I don't. I already have a pair. Yeah, but I need a fucking pair. But I, I wouldn't mind getting a newer one so I could, I could beat those, those up. Those up, yeah. And then, or at least put, put that aside, let it rock and stock. Facts. And sell it later on. Yeah, exactly. Facts. Um, but yeah, moving forward. Another question of the day for sneakers, right? What is considered a classic shoe to you? What are your criteria for a classic shoe? Damn, a classic shoe. Mm-hmm. Don't, Fuck. Don't, don't pull Breon now. Bear, don't be quiet now. <laughs> <laughs> A classic shoe, bro. I don't know. I don't know. What what would be your criteria? Let me piggyback off of you. Okay. So, for example, um, let's say Air Max. Right? Okay. Air Max. Any Air Max in general. From For me, overall, a 1 and a 90 will always be classic. Of course, a lot of people said the 97s, 98s, right. 95s. Uh, tw- but, like, it has to be generic. Like, well, I, I know you probably saw my video. It has to be durable. Of durable, course. yeah. But then majority of these shoes are durable. Yeah, I mean, but, now but they are, the, but... But <clears throat> main thing is bit hypeness. For example, I would say in today's world, the Panda Dunk is a classic. Fuck oh. you. What's the difference between a Panda Dunk right now and a white, a white Air Force One? And white Air Force One are considered classics. Yeah, but they don't have. What's the difference? They don't have the hype. Be well, they don't have the hype anymore behind it. Who? The white air forces. But that was during pandemic. You can't put that. Into well, it. no, not even that. You talking I'm about saying, like no. everyone wearing it and shit? <clears throat> not, cause okay, white air forces was out, but it became a bigger thing when Nelly dropped the song. It always been a big thing. Yeah, but they, but Nelly they skyrocketed. The, but I'm saying Nelly they became s- the poster boy, right? Because they skyrocketed like, after that. Yeah. yeah, that's what I meant by it. Like. Pandas? Why is it pandas really considered classic? Like, yeah, everybody has them. I get it, but like, it was just all hype though. But still, people are getting it still to this day. Yeah, I don't and, know. That quality you know is fucking horrible. It is horrible, but it's Air Force Ones is horrible too. I don't know. I have always had nice ass Air Forces. You can't say the quality on those are, are terrible, bro. I don't know. Mine is pretty pretty durable. They lasted a good while. How long did it take to start creasing? Uh, depending on how many times I wore them. So if I wore them for like a, probably like two weeks, if I had them on like every other day or something like that. Mm. That's the thing. It also depends on like how, how much you wear them now. You know what I'm saying? But that's the thing. Also, <laughs> I'm putting considerations because like, it's all about supply and demand. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? So if a customer wants it, or I say customer, or like a, uh, a consumer wants it, it's gonna be like, you know, it's going to be a non-stop train just going to keep going and going and going. Right. But sooner or later, it's going to break down. And then it's going to sit in store just like an Air Force One would. Mm-hmm. Like how a Chuck Taylor would. Facts. You know what I mean? Like, 
there's always going to be a classic silhouette, mm-hmm. right? But there's there's also going to be a couple classic. Uh, how will you say this? Fuck, how do you say this? Classic. Um, uh, colorway. Right. You know? Fair. Like Air Force One. All white is all, all whites are the main, main attraction. Fact. Or in the sec to second is basically what the black one exactly gang gang. <laughs> you know what I mean? Poo shiesty. Poo shiesty. Whatever these fucking young kids. It's, these young whippersnappers. <laughs> yeah. Little little sluggers. <laughs> you little gang bangers. <laughs> With your hip hopity music. Turn that shit down. <laughs> that yo 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 shit. <laughs> God damn, we old. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. I just broke my back just from laughing. Blasting that in the club music. (laughs) You ever thought picking up trash, young fella? Facts. Oh, shit. Stop littering, bitch. Facts. Um, And then we call them that. They gonna call us tree huggers and shit. No, I'm not a tree hugger. I I don't litter, though. I don't litter. You recycle? Yo, we Mexican. All we do is recycle, bro. I don't know how to, I don't get that. I really don't get it. Are you trying to make a racial joke right now? No, we did. Seriously, all we know how to do is recycle. If you notice, if you ever go to a Mexican household, they always got a bag of like reusable plastic bags. Well, you have a bin, so. Exactly. So if you're going to. I'm trying here. to think of the last Mex- uh, his, uh, Mexican person I've been to the house besides you. It's been a while. Yeah, I, don't, I, can't, I can't think exactly, of it. Exactly, bro. Anyways, uh, there's a list that. Uh, that basically showed up. Top five uncomfortable eh, top five uncomfortable sneakers, right? Pandas. According to freak sneaker freakers readers or sneaker freak re- uh, readers. Fucking kinky hoes. Number one, Jordan ones, of course. Fuck yeah, them bitches kill my feet, bro. Yeah, but, but here's the thing, because for some reason, everyone bitch and complains about it. I I think because I fucked up my feet. Feet nerves so bad. Probably I don't feel discomfort. Like the only, there's only certain shoes I feel this uncomfortable. Plus, we have to remember I don't tie my ones. I tie them, but they're not like suffocating me. I don't tie them. I literally just loop them through the hole, and that's mm. it. I don't tie them. Like you know how you have yours hanging out so long. I don't. I actually have them. Like did I have mine hanging out? Long? Bro, your shit was long as shit. Oh no, Breon did. Breon's, yeah, I was yeah. saying not mine, bro, because I, I I tend to tie mine. Look, you see, you see how loose mine's is. Oh, uh, you from still this? go up there, yeah. You know what I mean? Do you go all the way up? Nope, nope. I leave them out like this. Okay. Yeah, nah, like I said, it's not like the tongue or like the the tie them up part. Mm. It's literally just walking on them, bro. The fucking plant of the fucking sneaker, like. The insole, all that shit, it doesn't have enough support in it. Of course. So, like, yeah, that would be, like, a nice hour, two-hour shoe. Mm-hmm. But if you're going to be out all fucking day in them, bro, mm. your feet going to bleed. No. Mine's always been fine. Well, motherfucker, you're a race picker. Your feet was always in that race. Yeah, water. but your ass always be hopping fences and shit. What's Holy the difference? Shit. <laughs> <laughs> no, sir, we dig tunnels. <laughs> dig, dig, dig a tunnel. Dig, 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 dig a tunnel. Watch Raina come. Oh, shit. <laughs> you remember that from Lion King 2.5 or whatever? <laughs> was, uh, shit. Uh, but yeah, no, nah, those bitches are uncomfortable. I mean, they're normal to me. Like a casual wear normal. Like, it's not comfortable, nor is it uncomfortable. Nah, them bitches are comfortable to me. Uh, so, at number two, Jordan Forrest. Hey, I agree with that. Them bitches are uncomfortable. Hear me out. So... The homie uh, Lewis, uh-huh. I, I'm I'm ill vibe, uh-huh. right? Uh, he, mem- if you remember, he said if you go half size up on the fours, mm-hmm. most comfortable shoe, shoe ever. ever. And I'm like, I don't want to crease my shit because yeah. I'm a solid nine point five. Right? I'm literally you like everywhere with nine point five, right. except for like a couple of shoes. I might be a ten or I might be a nine. Nine, yeah. But Everything when it comes to Nike shoes, everything so far, nine point five. Right. Uh, same thing with Bapesters, nine point fives. Um, Lebron's nine point fives. Adidas nine point fives. Yeezy. A lot of people say go half size up. I was a nine point five. 
Well, like we, I know we talked about this before. I know, I know, in like certain brands, I know where my sizing is at. Like what, well, Harajuku? I need a ten though, because it's so narrow for me. Yeah, because I have really wide feet. But I'm surprised you don't need a. Yeah, which is fucking weird. Yeah, you're bigger than me. Yeah, but I don't know. I mean, they they fit. I haven't worn those in a minute. I should I should throw them on this weekend. Uh, I need to throw. Them. I might throw mine on tomorrow. Yeah, I might throw mine on this weekend. Uh, we'll see. Uh, at three Nike Blazers. I never had a pair. So. I I wear mine to the gym. So I think mine's are broken in. Probably. But I don't have an issue with blazers. You also remember, I don't wear Nike socks with crusty, cheap ass socks. I actually wear my Columbia's, mm-hmm. which you're. I, I can tell her about Columbia socks are really good for your feet, bro. I wear my Hanes. And my as, as grown ass men, I also t- I, I'm telling you too right now on podcast. Uh, wear some feet mask before you go to sleep. So oh, those yeah, 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 yeah. You breathe, you take out all the calluses and Just, shit. Yeah, yeah, it really works. It helps. This old man knows, bro. <laughs> I'm telling you, my, I'm telling you, bro. Fight him on Feet Finder. <laughs> you no, know, you know, I'm not. I'm not gonna get into that, man. That's that's disgusting. He said he's not blanquito. <laughs> uh, no, I'm not a fucking weirdo. Air Max, uh, at number four, Air Max 97. Never had a pair, so I can't. I had a pair. Um, when you tie them up, yes. Mm. If you let them loose, the most comfortable pair mm. I ever had on my feet. That's every shoe, though. I wishy-washy on those. Um, at five, Nike Dunks. Yes, fucking horrible. Because I had the Halloween dunks. Them bitches were horrible. They're not that bad. I tried on the fucking panda dunks at at the at Foot Locker. Fucking horrible. They're not that bad. No, they're bad, bro. Not that bad. They're fucking bad. All right. So, yeah, those were basically the five most uncomfortable sneakers. But it was made by sneaker freak readers. You know what I mean? Mm. So it was, I guess, a, a pole like voting. His, yeah, mm-hmm. yeah, a pole voting. That being said, uh, so a pair of shoes from um, was it Sotheby? Uh, Sotheby, so- Sotheby. Some, something. I can't pronounce it properly. So- Sotheby, you know the, the yeah 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 the auction auction people yeah yeah. Uh, Michael Jordan's nineteen ninety eight finals game two, thirteen breads or black and reds sold for two point two million. Signed. Autograph. Don't right. forget that. Oh yeah, too. True. 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 All right. So we're gonna talk a little bit about this, and we're gonna talk about what me and my homies were arguing about last night. Okay. Because this is a sneaker podcast. Fair. Your goat the is best goat in the fucking world. Is what? Michael Jordan. Okay. So you, who's my goat? Some bum ass fucking player. At least my fucking goat didn't kill his father. Fuck out of here. At least my goat knew his father. So. He doesn't have to waste money on a fucking funeral. Mm. Uh, what? At least, his, at least my goal to raise his kids right. Did he though? Where, where, Did he where, know? Where, where's uh, where's Marcus Jordan at? In Florida, getting getting probably pegged by uh, Pippin's wife or ex-wife. Hey, if they like that, huh? they like that. What you yeah. say, bro? They weirdos. Fucking retards is more <laughs> like it. All right. Oh, I I'm throwing all shit on the table. The fuck out of here, boy. But um, the reason I bring this up, right? My boy, he knows a LeBron. I'm a LeBron fan, right? A LeBron sexual. <laughs> sure. <laughs> and he he keeps saying that basically how can LeBron be the GOAT if MJ's the GOAT? And I'm like, and I tell you this all the time. Right. He was the first to do it. Right, yeah, facts. But guess what happens? You get knocked off, mm. right? Yeah. And there's the next one coming. I keep telling him that, but he's like, but he's the blueprint, but this, he's this, then he's that. And my other boy starts dick riding, who doesn't watch <laughs> basketball. Now, well, he said he doesn't watch it now because it's all pussy, right? Yeah, it, got, is all it, pussy. Is all pussy. it is all pussy. It is all pussy now. So, I don't, and I was like, but well, how does how does your two cents it matter when you don't watch, watch it? Watch it, facts. And then he goes, and then he goes, oh, but whose shoes sells more? Bro, you can attest to this. I say this all the time. Yeah. What? To me. To mm-hmm. me. His shoes. What, what is MJ only good for to me? His basketball playing skills. No, be real right now. <laughs> His shoes. Exactly. Facts. I tell them not all the time, but all of a sudden, they want to be, 
they want to gang hold me. I'm like, oh, but <laughs> and I say I rebuttal everything, and they just wouldn't take it. And guess what? They just gave up because I don't budge. Facts. You know what I mean? I don't budge. He protects his bron bron. Exactly. <laughs> He might not know look the, the lyrics to a fucking song, but he protect his brown bro. Oh, damn right, I protect that. I won't protect their hairline though. <laughs> bro, he needs to let it go, he does, bro. He does. But here's the thing: you know the difference between all me? goats go bald. Oh hell yeah, some goes crispy too. <laughs> yeah. Damn, I'm about to sock this man, bro. Oh my god. <laughs> Yo, if you don't hear him next week, you know what happened. <laughs> But hear me out, right? All I'm saying is this. Why, when it comes to MJ, right, y'all so gung-ho? Because, like, when you and me have discussions about, mm. like, fun discussions, right? Me and Breon have, like, sometimes serious discussions, discussions at work. Facts. But it's like, why can't y'all admit, like, someone is better Cause when I when all these stats kick in, mm. y'all say what six and no six and no. That's all. What can LeBron? And then, do? then when then y'all said what well, LeBron did three teams, y'all forget like he was on wasn't he on two? Technically two, yeah. And then oh another thing, my boy, right? He uh. was like, "What does goat mean?" I'm like, "Greatest of all time." Mm-hmm. And he's like, "So that's that's MJ." I'm like, "Bro, <laughs> stop." And then he talks about. Yo, I love you, bro. I'm not gonna put, I'm not gonna air your name out. I love you, bro. I really do. You one of my best friends, bro. You know what's crazy? This what? homie I'm talking about, uh-huh. he used to he used to hate my guts in grade school. Now he's one of my <laughs> bestest friends, bro. Like real shit. It's crazy oh, how the words. Love like, facts. He we used to he used to technically actually no he actually used to be my bully in high school. No, in grade school, right? He was my bully in grade school. Now he's my, one of my bestest friends of all time. Oh shit. Fair enough. <laughs> it's crazy. Fair enough. But oh, he shit. talked about uh, he used to wear Hornets. I'm like, what does the guy do anything right now? Fair. Well, because like he owns the Hornets. Like, right. Like, maybe. I don't know. But the fact that y'all so gung-ho about MJ being the GOAT and can't really grasp that someone else is better. Because the NBA uses him as the blueprint, right? Yeah. It's like, oh, he, he could be the next MJ. Why be the next MJ? Be the next you. Every- See, but I, I get that. But if if you, I don't know how often you hear like interviews or like when these kids like when they go into like the league and stuff. Mm. They always say, even with football, they be like, "Who you like Idol. imitate yeah. or idolize mm. as you're growing up?" Mm. And a good percentage is like MJ. Yeah, but here's the thing: those kids mm. are younger than us. You know damn well they yeah, weren't. But that's again, what I'm saying. But you have. And this is the thing you have the internet nowadays, bro. You could easily somebody hears MJ and they're gonna Google mm. who's MJ, yeah. and two two of the biggest searches gonna pop up either Michael Jackson uh, or, or Michael Jordan. Exactly. But you're right. But the, what I'm getting at is basically you. How do I say this without fucking sound ignorant as fuck? All right, fuck it, YOLO. We gonna go. A1. We going raw, like in your booty hole. Um, I was gonna say, let me say this. Baby mamas. I'm gonna say this, right? Mm. I even did this when I was taking a shit yesterday, bro. Of course you did. I swear to God. <laughs> Remember the picture I posted? You and me were going like throwing. Oh yeah, get throwing shot. Yeah. I, I po- I went on YouTube. Mm. I literally just put this: Michael Jordan blocked shots. Mm-hmm. Nothing comes up besides him blocking shit. I'm like, hardcore. Right, cool. Michael Jordan getting get, blocked. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Guess what? doesn't show anything up for some reason right i put lebron james blocked. Block. no blocked Block. shots uh-huh. everything <laughs> choking this choking that i'm like you see what i'm saying right it for some reason everyone's been on his dick so hard y'all even try to erase fucking memories <laughs> of shit that's because he was the golden child. I get it. Right. He supposedly saved the NBA from bankruptcy. I get it. Right. But what? You're going to fucking keep coddling this fucking bald headed bitch? You get what I'm saying? Like, it irritates me. Yeah. Because it's like, y'all can't accept the fact that someone is next. And that boy is Luca. Luca, I feel no, like Luca. Luca's going to be Luca, a bad No, Russia, hear, hear me out. I will say this now before it's too late. And y'all going to say, oh, he's a dick rider. Luca has the chance to be top five scoring of all oh, time. Oh, facts. Excuse me. If he's healthy. Yeah, that boy gets injured a lot too, bro. If he's healthy. And talking about that, 
his ass was it the Mavs are being under investigation right now. For what? Uh, they I pulled know. out his players and shit. All I that know. extra shit. I say I know they didn't make the playoffs. Well, they weren't going to make it regardless. Yeah, they were going to make it regardless, but still, I guess, didn't see that. But guess who shit. made it in the playoffs though? Seventy Sixers boy. That too. Third seed. <laughs> LeBron James and the Lakers, and guess oh, they what? Ain't going nowhere, bro. AD gets hurt too damn much. Yeah, but they're good. Cause you know who they guess they're playing against right now who? Uh, on Sunday? Who? Memphis. Who's their best player? <laughs> fucking Bane. I thought I you were gonna say John Morant. <laughs> eh. He he has. Wait, is, the is he high. playing right now? Is he? He, he, he he's should back. be playing. Yeah, yeah, he's back. He's playing. Oh, he watches gang bang clap clap. <laughs> Look at look at me, Dad. I'm shooting fucking pistols, bro. Clack clack. He said, "Yo, I fucking love those memes where they dropped the whole Eminem eight mile joint, uh-huh. where they pulled up his real record. Uh-huh. Like this bull is a gangster. His real name is Clarence. And he went. He really went to a private school. Yeah, his family's like good family and shit. They was like, bro, you ain't about that hood life. Sit your ass down. But that's how it is, though. That's how it's always going to be with these fucking like uh, basketball players when they when you make that money, you want well, you want uh, that that." How we, well, the thing I was, was going to say entitlement. Um, not entitlement. Recre- um, recreation. Uh, recre- uh, nah, the thing Notoriety. There you go. The thing is, even with like hip hop artists, they they say in a few songs, they want to be like the ball players. And, and ball the players. ball players want to be like the mm. rappers. So they all hang out with one another. But, I mean, these rappers nowadays ain't all about that life either, if you think about it. They're not. It's all about Most popping pills and fucking OD and, and they think it's funny and cool. Probably. Mm, I wouldn't know. I OD'd over fucking spicy and had the worst fucking shit. <laughs> shit show, no pun intended. Oh, shit. You know what I mean? Facts. Anyways, we gonna take a quick break, y'all. So listen to this in the loop music. So what? Back. We are back. We are back. So yeah, uh, would you ever buy a pair of any shoes for two point two million? Uh, fuck no. Exactly. <laughs> Whoever bought it, yo, you got money to blow. But Whatever. They got money to blow, and like, like, I feel why people are dropping this type of money. Cause he's well, one old. he's he's not playing no more. So one well, he's getting he, old. He's getting older. His shit is becoming more rare. Um, not really rare, but like more prized, I guess. Cause a lot of his games, game worn shit is not really. I don't think it's ever going up for sale like that. If you think about it, what? Like, um, how much of his like game? Well, to be honest, I. Here's the thing, right? When it comes to sports memorabilia mm-hmm. shit, you know I don't give a fuck. Yeah, you don't, but I'm saying it's a like, big market you, for it, though. Yeah, it is a big market for it. But you know me, I Like I said on the last podcast, yeah, I'll yeah, say it again, yeah. I'm not going to wear another man's name on my fucking back. Right. Unless they're retired. You know what I mean? Right. Other than that, I don't know. That's just me. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. Cause I don't even wear... Like, I'll even admit, I don't even have the LeBron jersey, bro. I'm like one of the biggest LeBron fans out there. It's just like... I'm just not wearing another. Hey, Brian, give him give him a free jersey. I bet he wear it. Probably not. Damn, not even for a free jersey. Nah, game worn free jersey. Nah, why would I wear one of his sweat on my shit for it? It sells money, bro. I'm not having another man sweat on my fucking skin. That's so. That's dirty. <laughs> that's retarded. <laughs> that's dirty. <laughs> no, I was but that's say, the thing though. Like, I was gonna say that that's uh, G word as fuck. Don't talk about Brian like that ever again. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, but like, see, shit like that sells, bro. Because, um, one, yeah, historical piece, I guess. Time and history. Uh-huh. But like, I don't know. I would never, I mean, if I probably had money like that, yeah. I'm going to say this, would. right? So, game worn, game worn stuff, right? Ath- off of athletes, correct? This is popped in my head. Hear me out. Hear me out. Grown ass man buys it. Off another grown ass man, clothing, right? Okay. But why can't we accept the fact that these, there's weirdos out there buying used underwears from these porn stars? <laughs> That's what I'm saying, bro. I don't know, but like I said, if I had the money, I probably would buy something like that. But I'm poor, so I won't. <laughs> I'm on the same boat as you. <laughs> but I don't know. Like I said, I'm always like, 
I'm rich. I'm rich with laughter. <laughs> Facts. <laughs> but I'm low key broke. <laughs> um. Well, what you gonna do with the like? You really gonna buy something like that though? Like, if I had the bread, probably. What would you right now on top of your head? If you could find one thing, right? What would it be? Probably a Kobe like his his last his last game jersey. I want a Kobe eight jersey. I don't Ooh. want. I don't care for a thirty four. Uh, I was about to say thirty four. <laughs> Uh, I don't care for a twenty four. I will. I will I care rock for more of a uh, eight. So I will rock his last his last game mm. jersey, mm. and I will probably get a eight jersey, but where he won the chip like the last game. Mm. Mm, fair enough. Fair enough. Fair enough. Fair enough. <clears throat> uh, excuse me. Uh, so lost and founds that we brought up earlier Facts. are supposedly restocking supposedly. next week. Supposedly, and. You think it's going to be a shock drop, right? Well, I saw some of the comments that it might be a shock drop. I feel like it might be because they, uh, well, yeah, they already posted that they might restock next week. Mm-hmm. But I feel like it might be a shock drop. It's going to be a random ass day, a random ass no, time. And be like, go, they go, need go, re- go. I feel like they need to redeem themselves. Because of all the well, bullshit. remember I couldn't, bullshit. I couldn't even get on. Yeah, because I know. Yeah, everybody had problems, but remember I told you I got lucky, and for some odd reason I hit. So I know there was the issue of people couldn't hit the fucking mm, purchase me. the tap button. Also, they were coming in moldy, mm-hmm. and what else? What other fucking problems? It wasn't too much. I mean, yeah, that's quality control, I guess. The moldy pair, but no, that's about it. Yeah, is people couldn't get in, and I feel like mostly bots got them. Oh, fucking, because uh, you probably didn't do it today. When I um, when I won the, um, the Air Max 1s, mm. there's a message now that Nike sends out. Mm. Um, there's like, we're checking availability. We're removing the bots. It literally says, we're removing bots. And we're going to see if you be able to hit a pair. What do you mean? So remember how before when you go on sneakers, mm. you, you know, you purchase it. Okay. And it's just checking availability. Or okay. you're in line, whatever, uh, and that's all it will say. Uh, but now it says check in availability. We are removing bots and you just have to keep waiting. So they are trying to attempt Trying to attempt and we've been bitching and complaining and <laughs> talking years. about this for years. And now y'all dumb fucks wanna do something about I it. I totally forgot the screenshot because I was just so in the moment of trying Bro. to get them. Uh, the amount of money y'all let me put... See, let me see if I can find it on Google. All right. Hear, hear me out, Nike. Hear me out. And everyone out there that listens to this podcast, right? Hear me out. The amount of money that y'all waste on PRs, okay? The amount of money y'all waste on retarded and rhetorical bullshit, right? To market anything. Yet now you guys care about bots. I mean, at the end of the day... Regardless of resellers or not, it's going to be sold out due to bots. So someone's buying it regardless. Right. You know what I mean? I mean, you're going to find ways around it. Uh, shit, I don't think I can see it, but... Uh, what? The little... I was trying to show you the little message that it said. But um, yeah, it, it literally says now we're removing bots. We're trying to see if you could secure a pair mm-hmm. and just keep waiting. That's fine. We'll, we'll see what happens next week. If it comes out, it comes out. If it don't, remember, I said if. Because they say if. You know what I mean? Yeah, it says if we restock, would you tell the group chat or keep quiet? Yeah, that's true. So, moving forward. Jordan 2-3 hybrids. The Chicago pair. What you think about those? Who had them bitches on their feet? I forgot who, but you know who wants them? Oh. Your little brother. Does he? Yeah. Fucking cornball. <laughs> he actually likes them. I mean... Oh, no, let me see the picture. I mean, they're good donors for threes. They don't look that bad, but I don't know. These see, hybrids are starting to get a little funky, like the 678... You know, 678 is too fucking wild you know, But the, the colorway, I, you saw the pink one, the gray pink one I posted? Yeah. Bro. Yeah, true. See, but these it's hybrids. It's just because the pink. It's the pink. You see, know me. I feel like they're getting these hybrids off the little bullshit that they saw, like the six rings. Because I mean, the six rings has, what, like eights, sixes? Uh, Six rings. I think all the shoes are six rings. Yeah, into one. that's what I'm saying. So whatever shoes he wore. 
I think it has like the 13s, the... Whatever he wore. Yeah, all the, in that hybrid. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Same thing with the other team as Jordans that look like... They look like 11s, but they have different mm-hmm. hybrids in them. I mean, look, I'm all for it. I don't care if people like them, they like them. But the fact that your brother likes them, I just like chopping on them. If the resale is there, I'll cop the resale. But for Bro, me personally, nah. The, I mean, I already have my Chicago team. I'm going to say this. I, t- I swear to God. <laughs> the last time any team Jordan or non-numeric Jordan shoe that resold was fucking Jordan Futures. And I bought a pair. <laughs> the only and Jordan... And they fucking suck because the quality is not there. The only two two that... Were they considered Team Jordans? Yeah. The ones that looked like sevens, they call it what? Team Flight? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. The ones that looked yeah, like yeah, sevens. I know talking about. And the Sons of Mars. I didn't... I I had the Sons of Mars when I was at college. I, I actually liked... Uh, I actually wanted one the first one. The white, yellow, and blue. I had mines were I think they were red and black, but they also had a velcro strap yep, around. Yep, yep, yep. yep. Okay, yep. Uh moving forward. Uh the Air Force One Terror Squad. There's official pictures that posted up. You mean the pandas? <laughs> he got mad. Bro, I saw that comment somewhere, bro. That shit pissed me the fuck off. Uh, JC's on the back tap, which is standing for Joey Crack. Joey Crack. And TS on the side. For Terror Squad. Um, To be honest, what I kind of don't like is the outline stitching of the TS. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, they could have like left, the, left that alone. But maybe they needed to just... just to make it pop out yeah. more or something. Yeah, I felt that. I'm not here to judge, but... I'm copping. You copping? Hell yeah. And I want Joey crack the sign, so I'm gonna go to New York and try and find him up in Bro, the Bronx. I, I would actually get him to sign that. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I'm gonna go to the Bronx, see if I can find Joey crack and have him sign him. Ah, I really do like this shoe. I really do want it, low key. Oh, I want. I probably won't wear it, but I just want it. Just facts. Like, if I could get Joey crack you know to sign him, I, I I don't want to wear any Air Forces. I just want to collect them. Ah, uh, like seven Air Forces. So I want. <laughs> it's funny. You know, it's funny. I never wore my Lover Boys yet either. I forgot you had them. Yeah, I literally I forgot I had them too. <laughs> oh shit! I gotta wear my lover boys. You better uh, put those fucking uh, little. Uh, I did the thingies on there. I did. What's it called? The little. Um, you can't. Whatever. I just put lover boy on it. Oh, okay. But I want it. I I totally forgot I had them bitches, bro. Mm. I gotta wear them. I want them still, but we'll see. <laughs> I'll, we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Uh, Jordan 11 DMPs are going to be over a million pairs. I heard. Uh, releasing in December. If we don't get a pair, I don't know what to say. Because last time I won anything off of sneakers was... I won today, but I canceled. (laughs) You're stupid. You and Brie are like fucking pump fake. Y'all make James Harden look like a pump fake bitch compared to the way y'all pump fake shit in sneakers. (laughs) I went to see if I still had it. (laughs) You don't. It don't count. It does count. You didn't get to the final Did boss. You, win? you don't get to the final boss anyway. That's why I ain't want to go to the fucking final boss. I know it's gonna go through FedEx. It, I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do Nike how they did me. They sold. What? They they they. What you gonna call it? They let me get to enjoy my my sneakers. So I ain't gonna let them get to them enjoy my money. Man, I'm talking about FedEx. That shit's still going on right now. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. oh yeah, what happened to the case? They call got- you, oh, they call, oh, that's the police report. So, yeah, like he, I say he, um, I had to do a police report and everything, and I'm still waiting for Go to reply back to my email. So, I mean, well, they have all the info, oh, them, yeah. but last time they messaged me was Tuesday. This week? Uh-huh. Okay. And, and basically... I sent them the email that how FedEx... Remember when they opened it for 14 more days? Is, yeah. They said uh, they will not go through with it because they claimed... Like, claim they it did, was delivered, was delivered. right. No. It right. was not. Right. You know what I mean? Because... And, oh, another thing. I didn't... I'm Only my wife knows. I brought up to her. So, yesterday, I was walking my dog, uh-huh. right? Um, I, I come back home. I'm at the corner of my block. FedEx truck pull up. Mm. Right? He's at the corner. Well, he parked up. I'm trying to get his attention. Mm. 
I'm like, yo, can I talk to you real quick? Boss beds off. Of course. Motherfucker stole it. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. And I'm like, are they either either he knows mm-hmm. or he just wasn't paying attention. Right. Benefit of the doubt. I don't know. Right. You know what I'm saying? I can't just true. assume shit. Because it could be a different driver. Right. That's true because not every driver has the same, yeah, route. the same route. But here's the thing. He's a new driver mm-hmm. because usually the drivers around my way are yellow mm-hmm. or Hispanic. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Yellow or tan, basically. <laughs> like pasty or tan. Facts. You know what I mean? And it was like, oh, shit. New driver. So I was like, that's why I just approached him. Right. Well, like I said, well, drove off. New guy. I've never seen this driver before. Right. So I was like. It could be he could be the one or he not right. But here's yeah. the thing: like it doesn't make sense because you know why? My sensitive every time I get something delivered, my camera's sensitivity is right. over a hundred is at uh, a ten. Mm. So you a fly can just fly through at the corner and fucking goes off. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Right. But we'll see. Yeah, we'll see. Uh, so supposedly Powerpuff Girls and Nike SB are doing collab drops in uh, holiday 2023. You fucking with these? Uh, fuck no. If anything, they probably would drop in woman sizing. Mm. Let me see. There's a green for uh. Nah, that fucking was that. Is that suede or butter nubuck? cup? Uh, bu- butter cup bubbles, bubbles and blossom. And blossom. Look at us knowing these. <laughs> hey, look at us. Look at us. <laughs> look at us. <laughs> Whoever thought? <laughs> Not I. Not I. <laughs> um. I don't know. That material looks kind of kind of funky. I think it's suede. That's what I said. I think it's suede. Suede's are nice, but not in that color. But you want to get any of them? If the resale is hot, yeah. Oh, so you always want it for resale. Resale, yeah. Okay, fair enough. Um, you might like this. This is where I brought this up. Jordan One Metallic Red are rumored to be returning, uh, in spring twenty twenty four. You could keep them. You don't like them? Fuck no. Really? Don't like them at all. I'm surprised. I actually want them. They're too plain. And lever boys are not? No, because I could put lever boy on it. You can do the same thing, go into the fucking uh, Sally's Beauty Salon and get those fucking things. True. Am I wrong? You're not wrong. Exactly. True. But lover boy has a little heart details on it and this and that. You want to give you heart? I'll fucking put some stickers on the bottom sole. (laughs) Yo, give me some stickers. (laughs) Well, not the thing is, um, okay, because I that kind of reminds me a little bit. You know when they dropped the fucking fours in metallics, mm-hmm. and they just had like shitty ass, um, yeah, like shitty it. ass quality or whatever. I mean, the it. metallics are like, like I get it. They wanted to make it look like it's a metallic, yeah. But like that, certain sneakers that didn't go with it. Like these, I could tell. The pictures look great. Don't get me wrong. But I'm pretty sure in person they're gonna look a little, a little too too much. But nah, I don't like them honestly. I actually like them because it could go with my metal, uh, metallic navies. Navies, you yeah. Know what I mean? Uh, moving forward, moving forward. Uh, Jordan One Union, August 2023. Um, so this is the first look of the Union LA collab. Fuck no, the twos Which, are better. What do you think about these? Nah, them bitches disgusting. The twos are better. Really? Yeah. Hold on. Talk to the people real fast. I like I like the twos a little bit better than these ones. Because these ones, it look like they got a fucking checkerboard on the side, bro. What do you mean? Like, look at this shit. From afar, that should look like a checkerboard. It's the... Uh, it's yeah, I know it's the stitching. But, like, that shit looks like almost like a baseball. So what? Nah, fuck that. You can keep it. So what? Breon would probably rock him. No, nah, he wouldn't. Yes, he would. He probably would. Uh, he would. He a hoe. He would. But nah, you, like, I'm really surprised you don't like the metallic reds. Nah, bro. That's why I'm still stuck on them. Fuck, fuck the topic <laughs> of them. You know what I mean? I'm surprised you don't like them. I don't like them, bro. I don't like them. For some reason, I never liked them. Um, I know, like I told you, there's only a few ones that I really want. Uh... The fucking Royal Toes. I, every time I see them, I fucking want them and I regret it not fucking buying them. Uh, Too bad, motherfucker. <laughs> Royal Toes. Uh, what other ones that I want? 
Royal Toes, the Bread Toes. Bread Toes. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Bread Toes. And Black Toes. Black Toes, Bread Toes, whatever the fuck you want to call them. And Jesus what was the Christ. other one? No, because there's two differences. The Black Toe is just the outlining that's black. They call that a Black Toe. Uh-huh. And the Bread Toe, I think, is a, is a red. Uh, Look it up real fast. Yo, what what yeah. hip hoppity name you looking at now? You said black toe, right? No, you said red toe. I said bread. Oh, bread toes. Bread toes. Hold on. Red toes. Yeah, here we go. Fucking goat. So they call those bread toes. Uh. The black toe is. Instead of that being red, it's just white. Yeah. They call those black toes. I forgot all about those. Yeah. So the bread toes, royal toes, and yeah, that's it. I'll get the bread toes just to piss you off. I'll fucking stab you. <laughs> Phone check, bitch. Facts. Nah, but um, yeah, man. I'm happy to have you back. Because, Facts, uh, you miss me. Damn, Breon, he's throwing shade at you. He said you were trash. I Damn. did not say that. Yes, he did. No, I didn't. There's not. a whole reason why he said, I'm back. <laughs> that should have been like MJ. I'm back. No, you're not. <laughs> no, Such you're a not. hater. MJ looks like a fucking uncle that can't be on the grill. Whoa, don't talk about LeBron like that, bro. Have you seen that man's fucking... Um... Man doesn't need a cook. Yeah, because he gets cooked. So you're right. By who? Everybody in the league. By who? He 37, 38, still dropping more points than these young bastards out here. <laughs> Fuck out of here. MJ could never. Because you know why his bitch ass was on the Wizards at the time. Or trying to be. He made a team. <laughs> made a team and where'd they go? Bro, you only... Yeah, that's true. Exactly. That's true. He couldn't fucking handle the fucking losing streak, so he fucking hey, left. All I'm saying is back. LeBron lost up to some washed up players. Like who? Dirk. Kid. I mean, yeah. They were all washed up, oh, bro. fuck yeah. And they... How the fuck you lose to them? Exactly. <laughs> no killer mentality at the time. I want to hear that bullshit, <laughs> bro. He had the three biggest players with him. You really gonna put Wade as the big player at the time? Fuck yeah. Man was fucking injury prone. You know damn well that's true. He still had him, even if it's on a- paper it looks good. And Bosch was a fucking glitter biscuit through champagne pack, champagne showers. The fuck? He was still doing it. <laughs> Man look like a fucking lizard. Like I said, he had those big three. I don't want to hear it. Man was only averaging 15 points a game. Shout out to the boy Jason Kidd. How? Why? For what? He's the one that was on that team. Wasn't, but he barely did much anyway. That's what I'm saying. (laughs) Shout out to Kidd. That's what I'm saying. Like the fuck, like Terry and fucking Dirk did more work than fucking Kidd. (laughs) Yo, Terry got banged on when, um. Did you see those memes? Oh, yeah. When LeBron when banged, banged yeah. on him, they was, was like, on got all... Terry. <laughs> he, Bro, every, everyone only recognized him. The younger generation recognized him as the the guy that got dunked on by Dunk LeBron. By Brian, facts. I mean, he's, that's his main uh, main career anyways. Mm, true. Uh, anyways. Any whore. Thank you for listening, y'all. I appreciate for rocking with us. Uh, if you have not, please follow my IG my TikTok, my YouTube at Fresh Philly. 215. Again, follow my YouTube, my IG, my TikTok at Fresh Philly. 215. Bitch That's how Breon right. said it. And you ain't tell him nothing. Because he's not. I don't give a fuck. He listens to the podcast. He should know. <laughs> he don't know shit. Cause... I don't give a fuck. <laughs> he was like, 215. I'm like, bro, really? Really? You unseasoned bitch. <laughs> Damn. Now he now he never want to try to join again. <laughs> no, we're going to bring him back. Bro, he's going to do this shit right. Man was like this. I'm like, really? Yeah, I heard that shit. You were like. You, you can fucking do that, but you can't fucking say blazers. <laughs> bro, he really froze for like, like 20, 30 seconds, bro. I know, because he was like. Uh, I was like, why did it go quiet? Did it cut off? Hello? <laughs> wait, wait, what was that uh, Chief Keef song? Uh, did the beat did the beat go off? What do you mean? That's how that's how that's how I remember it because Breon was like talking, and then uh-huh. they got like silent, and I was like, "Wait, did this shit cut off?" And there's a song that Chief Keef was like rapping to, and then it was like, "Yo, did the beat go off?" 
Uh, so it's, it was like something like that. Oh no, he, I was waiting for him to answer because he it took a while for him to answer certain questions. Bro, he was nervous, bro. That's what I'm saying. And like, it doesn't make sense because he's not like recording or anything besides vocal. It's not that hard because it's like that's why I'm not like really uh, upset about it because like we're talking verbally. You know what I mean? Yeah, but he was nervous, bro. And I'm I'm not gonna fucking I was not gonna edit that shit. <laughs> <laughs> he said we doing this. Raw. Like I edited the thirty second out, but other than that, that's it. Facts. <laughs> fucking Breon, you fucking whore. As much as you talk, I know, right? right? <laughs> as much as you talk, bitch, you should have been a natural at this. But nah, he he got nervous. It's okay. You Ain't dumb no whore. Well, when- Shame. 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 <laughs> Anyways, I appreciate y'all for listening. Have a nice day. Have a nice night, and we will see y'all next week. Wait, when we doing the movie? Oh yeah, yeah, we got we we all we got we had that. to do it. So if we wait, do, you're not here this weekend, right? I am this weekend. Or was that last week? It was last weekend. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Um, we could do it next week on a Friday night if you want. After we record, Bet. plan it, but uh, we could plan it a little bit better. What movie theater are we going to? Jersey. Yeah, probably somewhere. There's there. a cheap one. Like, it's like five, seven dollars a ticket. Bro. I know. I'm bougie, bro. I like the reclining chairs. I no, want the food. Recline, everything. Do they bring the food out to you? I've never been to one like that. Uh, I went to the one right here in the gallery. They do that. Is it good though? Is it... The food? I mean, I just grabbed like some boneless and fucking wings. And oh, some so nachos. one of them like ups? Like how much of the food? Uh, I can't even fucking remember, bro. Because the spot that I went to, right, is like you just get snacks. I said, because only the one in the gallery, that's like the only movie theater I've been to in years. Because I used to go to how the much, one. How much was it? I had a free ticket at the time. I went to see um, Spider-Man. The, oh, okay, okay. It's been a the while. The newest one? Not the newest, newest one, but whatever. When All three of them showed up. That's uh, the newest one. Coming bitch. home. Yeah, whatever. That's not the newest one. The newest one just dropped uh, with Miles Morales again. That's the newest one right now. The live action? No, the cartoon. No, that's what I'm saying. Live action newest one. I don't know what the fuck you want to call it. It's been a minute, but that was the only movie theater I've been to. Other than that, I used to go to the one up in South Philly. The yeah, the one on Columbus. Yeah, but that bitch got closed down forever. Mm-hmm. So yeah, I haven't been to a movie theater since. Yeah, but we'll see. We'll see, y'all. Anyways, um, yeah, probably just gone. Probably next week. Yeah, we'll next week we done. Plan it better. So we could talk shit about it. And Facts. Let know our review. Or we just fucking watch it for free somehow. I might bootleg it for y'all. No, nah, stop. <laughs> anyway, have a nice day, y'all. Have a nice night. And y'all will hear from us next, next week. week. Adios. Deuces. Peace. Peace.